Forte's an ultra high quality interface with AD and DA conversion at up to 24 bit 192 kilohertz resolution. It offers two Focusrite remote controlled microphone preamps and is compatible with both Mac and PC. I'm going to take you through the controls of the hardware and software control panel and show you how to benefit from door control with the big aluminium control knob and touch sensitive panel. To have complete control of all of the benefits, the interface is coupled with an intuitive software control panel. Firstly, I'm going to take you through the hardware features and controls. If I press the input icon once, I'll be offered a digital metering mode to display my input 1 and 2 level. If I press and hold the input icon, I access the input menu where I can select which type of input I want from mic, line or instrument inputs. I can also add phantom power, ensuring that the power supply is connected. If the Forte breakout cable is not plugged in, the input options will be greyed out also, so make sure you're connected as necessary. Pressing the speaker icon once allows you to adjust the overall volume of your outputs with the control knob. Pressing and holding the speaker icon here accesses a speaker menu where you can mute, dim, clear meter, exit and create a mono output. Similarly, as per the speaker menu, you can adjust the headphone level here with the knob. By pressing and holding the icon, you can access the same menus as the previous speaker menu to give you complete control of your feed. This final symbol is a tracking icon, which resembles door control. Pressing it once will allow you to access the current information on what's being controlled when the knob is turned and pressed. By pressing and holding the icon, you can configure precisely what you'd like this knob to control in your door. You can see there are three tabs here, the speaker tab, the headphone tab, and a question mark tab, which allows you a clear view of the routing you are using throughout. Here in the control panel, I can simply click on the microphone symbol to select my inputs as microphone, line or instrument and easily apply phantom power, high pass filter, phase reverse and pad. Also by clicking on the link button, if I'm recording two signals simultaneously and require matched input levels, I can click this and it matches the input sliders to the lowest set channel of the two. You can mute or solo inputs and outputs and change pan settings by clicking on the relevant controls in the digital monitor mixer panel. You'll notice the red and white card that arrives with the Forte in the box. Please follow all instructions on that card and register your product. Once registered, you can download the relevant software and drivers. If you run into any problems, turn the card over and all relevant details are displayed. Ensure you've selected the Forte as your input and output audio device in whichever door you're using. Connect the breakout cable and then either connect jack leads, i.e. for a guitar, or XLR cables for a microphone. Connect the power supply to ensure you benefit from phantom power. So there you have the Forte interface, incredibly intuitive with crystal clear quality throughout.